Here is a brief little video to show you how to customize the header in your patient newsletter if you're using Gmail to forward it on to your email list. So the other, there are other videos on the channel that show you how to customize the whole thing for forwarding, but what it did not show you how to do is to how to customize the header. So the first thing you do is open up the email that you received from the ND corner and you want to come over and hit forward and that's really all I'm going to say about the forwarding customizing. You can watch the other video to do the rest of it. But once you get it all set up and you've deleted all this stuff and everything, there is a trick to this. So what you want to do is preserve the formatting of the newsletter in this bottom part right here, the width of it. And so some people have just simply come in, clicked on the image, hit remove, and then tried to put their own header in, and it doesn't work very well. It makes this table collapse down into a very small. So this is what you do. Take your cursor and put it over here on the right edge of the header that's there now, the Medicine Talk header, and just click one time. And you should see that now you have this big blinking cursor right here. All you have to do is take your keyboard, go to your keyboard and hit enter one time. That will create a space within the block that you actually can't see, but it creates a space to receive another header that is the same width approximately as this header that's there right now. And those dimensions are 721 pixels wide. So 721 wide will fill up this space appropriately. Now, I'm just going to show you how you go in and you get a header. I'm assuming that you'll already have that done and ready to go because you want to have that done and ready to go. So you come down here to the little attach file symbol on the new Gmail format and just go over to where it says insert photo. You can't see that very good. Let me do that again. So right here, insert photos. You click on that and it's going to let you navigate to an image on your computer. So you just go to choose file and then you want to navigate to where that file is. Mine's on the desktop and you just choose it and hit open. It'll give you a little thumbnail. You click OK and then it inserts it in that space and preserves the width of the newsletter as it was formatted. Once that's done, you just come up and you click on that top picture and then you click remove and it's gone. Of course, the rest of the formatting, like I said, I showed you in the other videos, you can come in at any point and click into the boxes and you can change the information just by typing, right? I just highlighted it and typed. You can change things in the article like where it says, consult with your naturopathic doctor to consult with Dr. With Dr. Camp, etc., and it will you can customize it that way. But that's how you get the header into your own Gmail program, so your own header. Okay, that's it. Have a wonderful day.